Welcome back to Monster Jam the Game DS. Last time we finished up the Super Circuit and we're moving on to the Extreme Circuit today. And by circuit, I meant championship. Whoops. Yeah, Mesa Airfield 1. Let's do it. Oh yeah, this map. I remember this from the console version. This is where we start to see the airplanes and stuff out in the desert. I like these levels. I don't know if I'm gonna like them as much in this version, just given how difficult these races are. Kind of unfair, but, you know. This is a very open map. Oh, we can do a shortcut! Look at that! Am I supposed to be up here? Am I allowed up here? This is, uh... No, I'm not. It seemed like I was a bit off trail there. Oh, we got the airplane! Okay. I, I don't think I was the only one that made a mistake there. How was first so far ahead? What's going on here? El Toro Loco was kind of kind of killing it for some reason. Okay, now now the rubber banding's starting to pick up. Now we're all back together, or they three are. Why are my tires going into the ground? What is happening? Can the other? What? Alright, cool, cool jump, blacksmith. That would have gone crazy in a freestyle. Can the other trucks kind of wait up for a bit? I'm, I'm a little far behind here. I wonder if they separate more when I'm far behind. Because there's a good length between all of them. And now it's starting to shrink a little bit now that I'm catching up. Yeah, this game definitely doesn't have rubber banding or anything like that. They just happen to all be, like, equally as far apart when I start to catch up. Okay, I do need to start to try to catch up, because uh, this is the final lap. Alright, let's try to smash this. Okay, we needed someone to fall behind there. That's good for us. Okay, I'm taking third. That was a difficult race. I don't know what to say. First did incredible, too. Oof, that's a five-second difference. Historic Sunville. I don't even know what truck I want to be. I want to be Blue Thunder, because I'm blue. Abadi abada. Yo, look at that shortcut. It didn't even matter because now we're in last. Rubber banding might be the worst mechanic ever. <laughs> I don't know. It's not that bad if it's not so obvious, I guess. Like the way Mario Kart does it where you get better items in the last, like that's one thing. <laughs> but when it's just straight up like, yeah, the, the computers will go faster, a lot faster if they're behind you. So much so that it is essentially impossible to get a strong lead at all. Alright, just gonna, gonna fall in that pit. I'll try the plan. Why did it say I was in first? I was clearly not in first there. Alright, well I hope that happens on the last lap when I'm like a full mile behind everyone and the game just says, yeah, you're in first, right as I cross the finish line. A little while back, I looked up how drafting works because it kind of confused me. Like, I didn't understand how it worked in real life. And, um, but yeah, I finally looked it up and understood. Because basically, because there's a truck or a car or whatever it is in front of you, uh, I should focus. This is the final lap. I don't have time to explain this, but, uh, yeah, basically, it blocked the, the vehicle in front of you blocks the wind. Uh, and it's really cool, and you can uh, do good things with that mechanic. I actually got first. Probably because of the drafting. Mesa Airfield 2. Any new trucks yet? Would love to try something new here. Okay. Was I not supposed to turn? I... That is an insane shortcut. They had to do a whole turn there. Why would you not go that way? Actually, I have a lead. There's a lot of stuff to smash, so... I think because I'm in the lead, there actually have things I can smash. Dude, I'm actually- I'm doing okay for once. This is a miracle. Uh-oh. Okay, now that I've made one small mistake, they're right behind you. Yep, here they come. I hear them. Okay, here's the short- Did I manage to hold first for a whole lap there? I actually did, didn't I? That's gotta be a first. That never happened. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it this lap because there's not as much stuff to really smash here. But I can I can try my best. Look at me go. Dude. This is actually pretty good. 
This, this has to be my best race ever. <laughs> I say that right now, but things things can turn around pretty quickly. We're actually holding first. This is unheard of. I'm gonna hold first for a whole... I'm going the wrong way. Dude. I, I still have a lead. Uh-oh. Wait, that was a mistake. I don't have any boost to work with. Okay, they're catching up. They're catching up, but I don't think it's fast enough. Cool. All right. Our best race ever by far, I would say. I don't know what changed. I guess that just that one shortcut probably made a lot of a difference there. All right, moving on to Eliminator. All right, let's see if we can do just as good on Eliminator here. This is actually a place where we'd want to try to get first each lap. There's actually a benefit to doing so. There's just a lot of stuff to smash too. I think that really helps us. There's got to be something different about this race. It's like the rubber banding broke or something. Okay, just going to do a 180 real quick. Look at all this boost. Look at this combo. We got a freestyle combo going. The rare eliminator win. Uh-oh. Maybe I spoke too soon. Okay, there's like nothing left to smash. We might not make it. Uh, can get the cars. This pole. Oh boy, he's right behind me. He is right behind me. But we won. All right, that, that's just our race. Stork Sunville. They got this game's theme playing from the, the console version. That's actually really interesting that in the DS version, they just play whatever music on the menu screen. Like, I think it's just random. But yeah, in the console version, it always plays this song first. In fact, I don't even think I've heard this song on the menu screen yet. I don't know if it can play. I'm assuming it can. It probably just is RNG. I kind of feel like they should have had the song always play first. Like, it's such a good song for this game. I don't get tired of hearing it, even though it's the only song that plays generally on the, the console version on the menu screen. I mean, if you wait long enough for the song to end, it'll play another one, but I hardly ever get there. I, uh, I just lost. <laughs> Wasn't really thinking there about the fact that that was Eliminator. It's an important thing to keep in mind when you're, you know, trying not to get last on the first lap. We were doing pretty good there, too, up until, like, the end. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. You know, I think maybe we just weren't making enough of an effort to try to run into stuff. Because, like, yeah, if you, uh, if you crush stuff, you get boost. That's how that mechanic works. Just seems like now that I'm kind of making more of an effort to smash stuff and boost, it might be helping a bit. Says we are in last. Approaching the end here. Okay, just gotta make a run for it. Will the boost last us? Okay. Imagine if I was trying to go for first and everything in this game. Eliminators would be so difficult in that respect. I would not want to have to go through that. Okay, we're at the end again. We need to shortcut. Right. Come on. Oh, no. Okay, we need to pull ahead. Oh, that's not going to help. Okay. As I said, I'm glad I'm not going for first on everything. All right, freestyle. Feels hard to commentate these freestyles. Like, it's so desolate, man. There's no audience. Like, I'm not feeling it right now. There's just like a couple, there's only a few obstacles on the, the track, it's just, I don't know man, I just don't know what to say, oh. Oh, let's try that again. I don't like that to scroll to my truck every time. If you, like, I, I do choose Gravedigger a lot and uh, you know, Monster Jam games, but I think a lot of the reason I do that so much in this one is because, again, you do have to choose your truck every uh, event you do. And if I want to go to like Max D or something like that, I gotta scroll all the way through that truck menu just to get to them. <laughs> Whereas with Gravedigger, it's like, okay, I just 
I just gotta choose the first truck. It'd be nice if this saved your spot on the menu on whatever truck you chose last. Donuts are so bad in this game. They don't even give you that many points. Like, it's not... It's almost not worth it. Alright, I think we did okay. Right? That was a decent run. This place is going crazy after that amazing freestyle run. Alright. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna end this episode of Monster Jam the Game 2007 DS right here. I think next episode's actually gonna be the finale. We only have this section of the Extreme Championship, and then we have the World Finals, which I think is just two events. So, yeah, we're, we're pretty much almost done here, I think. But yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe to see more, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.